in St. Louis County, Missouri, delivering this baby three weeks early took a miracle. Fire and ambulance address of the emergency. Uh, hi, uh, I think my mom is in labor. Thankfully, an older sister, yes, named Miracle, was there to help. She said, call 911, and then I call, and then that's when she had the baby. On the other end of that phone, and with an ambulance on the way. My head is here. Okay, I understand I that. We're gonna, I'm going to help you deliver the baby, okay? <gasps> Dispatcher Scott Stranghoner. I learned pretty quick that we had a serious situation. Um, we have a set of protocols that we follow, and she <laughs> followed all of my instructions to a T. Um, it did an amazing job, and a few minutes later, we had a, another baby girl in the house. At only 10 years old, Miracle kept her cool. Is the baby breathing? Yeah, she's breathing. She, okay. I think she's crying now. Okay, all right. You're, you doing, okay? you're doing a really good job. And helping mom Viola through the whole process. It was definitely a miracle because once I had the baby and she came out, I couldn't really like grab her or pick her up or nothing. So then a miracle came and she was trying to wrap her up in a towel. She kind of rubbed her back a little bit so she can cry. So she was real helpful. I am very thankful. By the time the ambulance arrived, baby's sister Jayla was in Miracle's arms. Just picked baby up first thing, wrapped her in a blanket, yelled happy birthday. It was good. We love seeing good outcomes for families and stuff like that. We do see a lot of bad things, but um, one of these special moments is the best. This is what we do it for. The older sister now celebrated as a hero. Um, wonderful job. So we're so proud of you. But Miracle's focus remains on that little sister in her arms. She's really cute. She doesn't cry a lot, and I get to hold her a lot. Carrie Sanders, NBC News. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.